Who scored that? Salah. More Salah. More oh, Salah. I don't like the Liverpool. Who do we support? United. United. Right. Okay. More Salah. Right. So we're going to go and uh, play at Morecambe Golf Club. Nine holes with my little man. Say hello, Ted. Hi. Hi. He's dragging me out for nine holes. And while we're out there, we're going to do a little bit of product testing. Uh, which club are we going to test, Ted? Don't know, you don't even know yet, do you? No. Mm. We'll, we'll find out. Uh, we'll find out soon. But let's head off down to the club, Ted. Yeah, it's a bit cold out there. Got a few layers on, Ted. You got your bobble hat on, yeah. cap on. Just watching the football. Okay, dear, let's go. You got a tea peg? Yeah. What ball are you using? That's a lucky ball. Yeah, on it. Man United. Oh, quality. All right, so we're going to tee off on the seventh. So Danny's going to do a little bit of uh, product testing on the course. Got these in the bag, the Ben Ross Evolution R. So you've seen my video recently on the driver, so on the hybrid, yet to do the fairway here, but we're gonna put hit a few of these out on the course with my little dude. I'll put these to the test down here at Morton Golf Club. Okay, so we're gonna do some testing with the Ben Ross Evolution R with Ted. Ted might even have a little hit yourself. Do you want to have a hit with the new driver? No. Put your hat on straight. <laughs> Okay, so you've seen my, possibly seen my review video. If you haven't, I'll put a little, little link up there and you can go and check that out first. Right, Ted, are you going to go first then? Yeah. Okay, right, go then. Are we playing play for any money? Yeah. What? Uh, what are we playing for? Three pound. Three pound, right, okay. Go on then. Actually, ten pound. Nice and smooth. Ah, good shot, dude. Nice finish. Yeah, so really impressed with the uh, Ben Ross Evolution R driver, to be honest. The sound of it was great. Uh, feel off the club face was superb. That, that one felt really good there. Just maybe a little bit off the bottom of the club club there. Uh, just, just slightly on that right-hand side of the fairway. But, yeah, it's a really nice driver. I think, uh, didn't know the price at the time when I did the review, but I believe I found out now that it's 199 selling at pounds, uh, which is un unbelievable value for money uh, with the technology getting the quality of the shafts um, so it's, it's impressive drive there good swing great shot do you like that one good hit happy I think you might need a lesson on putting your bag on <laughs> Okay, so that tee shot probably went about probably 280 there, a little bit into the draft. We're just on temporary greens at the moment because of the frost we've had here, so they're just protecting the, the greens here. So uh, putting won't be great here, but let's see if we can get this uh, get this close. Where are you at, Teddy? Just there? Yes, sir. All right, mate. Should we have it closest to the pin? Yeah. See if we can get it closest. Nice little eagle start there, a little chipping. Two under after one, might go in now. Good shot, down the path. That's one way to get a bit more. That feels really, really solid. I can't even break it. It's proper ice. That is rock hard, isn't it? You're not going to hit it off the path. You're going to hit it off the path? 
Go on then, shows your skills. You can take a drop, you know. You can take a drop as opposed to scratching your driver. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's it, no near the hole. <laughs> yeah, that's a good drop. Alright, smooth swing, buddy. Not bad. Right. You need your patter. Right, so here's my tee shot here. Again, just up the right side here, just, just off the fair on the rough, but the flag is just over there. Again, another temporary green here. That felt really solid, that tee shot. Again, just push that a little bit on that round side, but I'll take that any day. You on the green, Bart, pal? You on the green? Good man. Right, what we're going to choose here? Probably a little sand down here, I think. Shot said. Right, this one's going to be a test for the driver here now. So I've got the 11th hole here at Morecambe Golf Club, straight back into the wind here. So really going to test maybe uh, the flight with the Ben Ross here, see if they can get that spin low. Obviously, I need to get my strike right here, get that spin low, and see how it works into the wind. Okay, so there we are, 11th hole, straight up that way. Flags over that bunker. Again, another temporary green here. So, go on, Ted, you're going to lead the way. Chat. What up, buddy? Not happy with that one. This is the real reason why he wanted to come. Go and play in the ditch. Pulling, hits his ball in the ditch, goes and pulls it out. He's dying to go in a bunker as well. Again, that was a really, really good ball flight. So that was back into the wind, as I said there, and that didn't climb at all. So that was a good strike on my behalf, but that was definitely spinning in. Uh, definitely a bit lower there. You could see it just sort of pierce the wind a little bit there. So. Uh, just, just up that left half of the fairway, I think it was, so it's found the fairway, which is good. So I think from the comments that we've had on the channel from a review of the Ben Ross Evolution R driver, I've been really, really positive, I think. Uh, definitely following up from what I've sort of seen with it, you know, it's, a, it's definitely a good looking golf club. The finish on the head is definitely a higher quality than previous models that Ben Ross have done. Obviously there's a bit of tech in there, just ability, you can move that back weight on there, you've got that recessed channel in the front, which helped a little bit of ball speed off the club face, off maybe off, off centre hits. And then obviously got a neck adjustability so you can dial in that loft and also that face angle. What a wall he's left his driver back on the tee. Always oh, one. Are you out of breath? That was a long way back, wasn't it? Right, smooth swing, catch your breath, get those hands together on that grip. Good boy. Oh, great shot. Love ripping that off the deck, don't you? That's all right, pal. Nice one. Maybe in the bunker. No, it's not. Right, so here's the tee shot here from 11. So, as I say, just on the rough, just off the fairway here. Flag is just there. Again, temporary green. So I've got about, uh, about 50 yard pitch. time now. So here we are on the 11th green, 12th tee. Here's a high point of the golf course. Lovely there, you can see the clubhouse there. There's Ted. There's the Morecambe Bay. As you can see, stunning views. A little bit overcast today, so not quite 
getting the views of the Lake District Hills, which you would generally sort of see over that way, but you can appreciate really stunning part of the golf course here. What club are you hitting here, Ted Driver? Yeah, that's right. Uh, on the green. On the green. On the green? Yeah. Feeling confident. Driver on the green. What par three is this hole? Oh, it's hit that tree. It's not too bad. What club have you got? Tree wood? Did you get that? Tree wood. <laughs> right, nice smooth swing. Oh no, has that gone in there? Oh, great shot. Yes. Oh, we've got birdie. Knuckles. Right, let's really test how we can shape this driver now. So, seventh hole here, need a little bit of a draw is the ideal sort of shape. So, we're going to see if this is easy enough to shape. Right, let's see how it's going to go. Oh, well off the fairway there. Right over the trees. Down it goes. Oh, I land on the trampoline. I'm going to hit another one. That didn't draw. Where was my draw? That was in the trampoline. Let's try that one again. Up the right hand side, we'll draw. Ah, that's the one. Oh, are we enjoying it? Yeah. Are you playing all right? Yeah. You're hitting, hitting driver really well, aren't you? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to play one more hole and then should we go and watch the football? Yeah. Who's playing? City Chelsea. City. Go on Chelsea. You want Chelsea to win, do you? Yeah, because City up top of us. Yeah, we need to catch City up, don't we? United need to catch City up. So we want, we're want we cheering Chelsea, are we? Yep. Excellent. Go on Chelsea. Nice shot. Okay, so this is the first tee shot there, which didn't quite get me draw on. So there's the fairway where Ted is. So didn't quite get me draw, left it out to the right, just cut that against the wind. And this is the difference of gaming situations because now that's there. My second one I hit, which I hit much better with the draw, is all the way down there. It's probably a good a good 80, 90 yards further on there, purely through shape of shot, strike, and using that wind. It's all about strike, guys. Okay, and here's the second one I hit. That was a great strike, nice draw there. You can see that's run really a long way down there. And the ducks are walking on water. Would you believe it? Might be ice, Ted, but it is ice. All right, well done, Ted. Well played. You enjoy that? Yeah. Played well then, didn't you? Yeah. Nice to get out and play some golf together, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's, go Let's go and watch some football. Come on then, buddy. What have you got, Ted? Are you happy? There we go. City, Chelsea, nil nil at the moment, half an hour in. Thank you for watching and please hit the subscribe button and the like button. Thank you.